In this video, we're going to take this data set here, put it in the TI-8384 calculator, and find the mean, the population standard deviation, and then a sample standard deviation. So the first thing we need to do is put it in the list one. That's under stat, and then click edit. I will put all this information here into the L1 list. Remember, if there's something in a list, like I have over here now in L2, you can go all the way up to the top, hit clear, and enter and we'll clear it. Once it's in there, quit back to the main menu and then click stat over to calculate and we want one, the one var stats, one variable stats. Click enter and it gives you the mean, x bar on top, gives me the sample standard deviation and then the smaller case sigma x is the population standard deviation. So the first question was compute the population standard deviation, 6.9 sigma, that would be this portion right here. Now on the second one it says compute the sample standard deviation of sample one. Let's just do that one, Jeanette, Jeff, and Perpetual. So Perpetual, we'll put that information in there. We go back to the list, sorry, we go back to stat, edit, and I'm going to clear this out, enter, put our numbers in there, 70, Jeanette, 88, and Jeff, 84. Now I second quit, hit my stat, over to calculate, and VARS1, enter again. That's my new mean of my new data, and then my sample standard de deviation, 9.45. So if you round it off to one decimal place like they want, 9.5, and that would be what the san sample standard deviation is. So keep in mind, sample standard deviation, population standard deviation.